two days we'll do IDE integrated development environment is basically a code editor so uh, this is IDE I just showed you a code editor which I had was PY scripter with a lot of code editor so you can use any code edi editor which you use so the one which you'll be using in class is PY charm so I guess most of you must have installed PY charm Unfortunately, I did not install PYCharm. I'll be doing it today itself, so that we all are on the same page. But you use you use anything; it's one and same thing, right? But I'll use PYCharm also because you'll also be using it. So it's saying, how can you download? So you can download PYCharm from the link given below jetbrains.com slash pycharm slash download and then you can download it from the community edition but I guess uh, you don't have to download pycharm if you install virtual machine and the python entire package which they have given you and has given you and run python through the virtual machine um, you would have pycharm in that virtual machine python itself so all those who have installed virtual machine Oracle virtual machine and are able to run Python through virtual machine of Oracle I guess you you are able to uh, log in through pycharm or is it giving something else because I have not installed it yet I generally use coding.com or pyscript saying uh, how to go into Python we should have started from here so how to go into Python just write Python and press enter you get the Python terminal command line okay. so in your terminal you can type Python let's do it again as this says so that you know yeah and we got a Python command line So uh, Python is also an interpreter. Basically, it reads, reads other Python commands and executes them. Uh, they are compiled automatically before it is scanned by other in interpreter. So once you are inside Python, the command, just type command and it will automatically happen. And you have to just then write press Control and D to exit, exit from there. Just uh, let's try something. Let's write print under quotes. Uh, you know, welcome to the world of Python. So let's do this. We'll write print. So this is welcome to the world of Python. So please everybody do this. So first thing I did, I wrote print under quotes welcome to the world of Python and press enter it will show whatever was inside that quote. And the second one I wrote x equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and when you write x it will show you the entire box. It's whatever you have, uh, you know, allotted to x. So these are two basic commands which we did but it's very important to the basics also. <coughs> 